First graders, welcome to week three of School on Computer. Um, so just like last week, I'll, I will have three videos posted for you, and each one will be about five minutes. You can watch them all today if you want to, or spread them out depending on how your schedule is. This first video, we're going to go over um, our letter cards, do our letter sounds, and our uh, sound drill in our book, and also go over some of our sight words, okay? All right. Look at our cards. Today we're just going to say the letter sound. When we come to the vowels, we're going to make both sounds. So quickly, let's review our vowels. Ready? Our vowels are A, E, I, O, U. Sometimes Y. Any letter that's not a vowel is a consonant. Those hardest working vowels can do two things. They can say their letter sound or their letter name. Okay, I'll, make, uh, I'll show you the card. You make the sound at home, and then I'll make the sound here. Here we go. Ready? Mmm. Oh. Qua. K. Z. Mmm. K. J. D. Oh, here's a vowel. E or E. Yeah. That's that Y. Sometimes it can say I, sometimes it can say E. Or it makes it sound yuck. Yeah. Another vowel, I or I. G. Mm. X. Mm. Another vowel, A or A. S. T. Another vowel, A or U. Oh. Another vowel, a or o. P. P. And then we're back to mm. Good job. Last week, we didn't go through our sight words. So let's look at those today at the bottom of our page. We call these sight words because these are the words that we want to learn to know quickly by sight and not have to sound out because we're going to see these words so much in print. They show up um, on the page frequently. So we always start out by sounding them out the first time we see them. Now this is a word that you've learned in your first grade classroom already, but we haven't talked about it um, in our reading class with me. So this is the word there. Starts with the TH brothers. And it's a little tricky. Um, because that doesn't, that E-I-R doesn't look like it would say air, but it does. So this is the word there. And there are actually three different ways to spell there. So this first one is a contraction, and we've talked about those a little bit in class, where you take two words and you're going to push them together. And where you take a letter out, you put this um, apostrophe. So this there is actually the word they and are pushed together and it has the same meaning. So wherever you use the word, this spelling of the word there, you could also use the two words they are. So they are going to the store, they're going to the store. This there down here, T-H-E-R-E, -E, um, is means a location. So I'm going to put my paper over there. It's a place. And this there, the one that we're working on today, T-H-E-I-R, means it belongs to them. So um, if I say, it is their dog, it's the dog that belongs to them. All right, let's go through these words. These are the same words that show up in your homework folder on those um, sight word cards, the flashcards that we want to practice every day, okay? So here we go, let's say our words. Okay. There, of, his, to, than, are, look, is, has. Good job. And today in our sound drill, we're working on E-A. So last week we worked on E-E, -E, saying the sound E, because two vowels next to each other, when two vowels go walking, the first one is usually going to do the talking, so the first E was saying its name E. So here we have two vowels again, E and A, and when they're next to each other, the first one is the one that's going to do the talking, so he's going to say his name E. So when you see E-A, 
um, usually it's going to say E. Okay, let's look at a couple words where you would see that. How about this word? E-A is going to say eat. This is the word eat. And we might have this one with that consonant blend T-R. Ready? Treat. And one more E-A word. Get this one. We have that E-A saying E. This is the word seat. our sound drill. Ready? I'll touch it. You say it. I'll touch the letters. You say it at home and then um, um, we'll say it together. Here we go. Ready? E. Ing. E. Ch. Ing. Ah. E. E. K. Er. Ah. I, e, e, k, a, p, ch, er, e, m, e, e, a, e, k, ch, k, e, e. Good job, first graders. Okay, for the next video, you're going to want something to write with and something to write on. So get pencil and paper or whiteboard and dry erase marker. And we're going to practice writing some words and sounding some words out. Okay, so see you in a little bit. Bye-bye.